Hello everybody, what's up? What's going on? This Cornelius here doing a food review. I really don't do this type of thing, so just bear with me if it's kinda you know, it's not what you used to. But pretty much what I wanted to do is do a review on the um new panda signature Roman versus the Moroccan Roman and um pretty much see what's the difference. Um there's definitely a taste difference here. Uh, let's see. First, let's, let's get into the origins of these these two brands or whatever. Uh, okay, so the Marekin is a Japanese-American brand of instant ramen noodles and um, cup noodles produced by Toyo Suisan of Tokyo, Japan. The Marekin brand is used for noodle products in Japan and as the operate and as the operating name for Toyo Soy Sense Division in the United States, Moroccan Inc. They were founded in March 28, 1953 in Japan and 1972 in um, the United States. Okay, and as for the Panda signature, it's pretty much uh, um, it's produced by Albany Forms. And uh, when I go to their website, it says, um, it's uh, the Panda Roman noodle is a top favorite created with quality ingredients and available in, it's available in up to 10 different flavors. We offer a great variety and a, a different package of sizes, whatever, here you can see this there, boom. So pretty much um, when I taste both of these noodles, like I'm, I'm pretty, a pretty big food critic so when i taste this noodle here this is the um the regular thing everybody's probably used to you see that smoke coming up um okay mm. okay mm. that's amazing they doing it right this brand here is um i guess any flavor you get with this brand you can't lose this it's a name that you can trust when it comes to noodle top ramen. Okay, now we're coming over here to the panda. Let's get it. All right. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad, but a bit, a bit um high on the sodium intake. I can definitely tell. I could definitely tell. Um. And that's why I actually did this review because I actually were excited about this. I'm like, what is this? So I went and tried a pack, and so it was it was pretty decent. It was good, you know. I did I didn't have no complaints, but at the same time, it made me think like, what's in this bag? So let's check out what's in the bag. This is the Panda Signature Roman Noodle Soup. Okay, they got it kind of hidden. Come over here, calories. You know what? Let's just do them together. All right, it seemed like they both got, you know, 370 calories per container. But let's get into the other things. Let's see. Okay. Um, total fat, 15 grams. Saturated fat, 7 grams. Cholesterol, zero. Sodium. Oh, my gosh. That's pretty high. Okay, so sodium here is at 63% of this pack that's this going in the garbage can definitely no garbage can now let's see I, i've never looked to see what these are but let's see what they are what the sodium is okay so the sodium here is 700 milligrams so it's 30 percent of this pack so it's that's still pretty that's a pretty high amount of sodium but at the same time is is do, definitely doable but but the sodium with the um with the panda signature is too much on the high side like um i noticed that walmart replaced this brand and i noticed and, and i'm talking about like a california walmarts and so this brand disappeared and i noticed that walmart start shelving hell of this like every flavor of, of this panda signature so maybe they had a new deal maybe they closed the deal with this company and opened a deal with this company and this the shelves are being stocked with nothing but this so I see this guy disappearing and this the new guy. 
So I'm like, all right, I'll check it out. So um, pretty much with this review, hopefully anybody who's wondering what the difference is between these two brands, maybe I gave you an idea of something. Um, I wasn't trying to go too deep, but these are just my opinions and my thoughts on um, both of these um, different brands of pretty much the same thing that you may be looking for. You and, and as you can see, the colors are the same. So they're going for the same consumers that Marochin Roman noodle soup has like their consumers, their customers, because you could tell with the color. Like if you're just going in the store, you say, oh, okay, Roman, it's pink, you know, so you think it's the same thing, but it's definitely not the same thing. And once again, before I leave, I want to say 63% sodium. Let's just pull it back. That's that's too damn high right there. That, that's just, my chest was hurting after getting a bowl of these. But with, with these, you know, I'm not saying like noodles is healthy for anybody anyway, but you just want a little snack. I say still go with these. You can't go wrong with this brand. This is a well trusted brand that's been around quite a bit of time. And um, if you're going to do noodles, definitely you might want to stick with this brand. But, you know, to each his own. Peace out.